Who's the clever boy, then? You are. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> she caught me talking to myself. Actually, I wasn't really talking to myself so much as congratulating myself because I have turned one of these into one of these. Now, all you need to do this is uh, some old wrapping paper, like that, you see, and then you want some <coughs> scissors. Make sure they're the round nose safety sort, won't you? And then you need some sticky tape. Good old sticky tape. After that, of course, everything is easy. Even a fool can do it. <laughs> anyway, excuse me, I've got uh, quite a lot more books to cover, so why don't you go and visit Sushi and Sweep and Sue in their bedroom? They're actually... Well, guess what they're doing? You got it. Covering books. I asked them to do one each. I wonder how they're getting on. Sooty, please keep still. I've nearly finished. Just got to fill in this last ear. What, Sweep? What am I doing? Well, hang on. There, finished. Well, I've just covered my address book like Matthew told us, and I've done it in plain paper, sweep. Then I've done lots of drawings of my favourite TV star all over it, then coloured them in. <laughs> yes, I know it's Sooty. Sooty is my favourite TV star. <laughs> Has Sooty covered his book yet? I don't know. Have you, Sooty? Oh, yes, of course. He says he's been too busy posing for me. <laughs> well, what about you, Sweep? Have you covered one yet? <coughs> Have you? <coughs> it's quite difficult, isn't it? <coughs> no. <coughs> well, I found it hard, especially making sure you stick it in just the right place. <coughs> Didn't you find the pot using the sticky tape tricky, Sweep? <coughs> no. <coughs> Where's your book, then, Sweep? <coughs> I said, where is your book, Sweep? What do you mean, which book? The book you've just covered. <coughs> yes, that book. We'd like to see it, wouldn't we, Sooty? <coughs> You'll go and get it. Good. Describe it, sweep. I despair of you sometimes. Sooty, you going to cover your book? All oh, right, you're going upstairs to do it. Good idea. Get as far away from this sausage brain as possible. You want him to go with you to lend a hand? Why? Because he's your best friend. Well, so far, we've seen how nicely Matthew covered his book, and we've seen Sue's book, beautifully finished, and we've seen Sweep's pathetic attempt, which actually wasn't too bad for someone with a brain the size of a dried pea, and now it seems we're going to watch Sooty covering his book. So take it away, maestro. Well, I must say it's very attractive paper, Sooty. One simple fold should do the trick, and that... Oh, dear. Seems to have unfolded itself. Never mind. Try again. And... Uh, oh. It's done it again. Come on, Sooty. You can do it. A bit of tape should do the trick. Yes. Except you can have a lot of trouble with sticky tape. Can't you? Ah, uh, a bad workman always blames his tools, so Sooty's getting rid of that paper. And he's decided to try with a new piece. Better luck next time, Sooty. That's it. Put the book on the paper. Good boy. Good start. 
One simple fold and... Hey, presto, you're in a mess. Oh, dear. Sooty thinks perhaps the tape's to blame. So he pushes it to one side and calls Sweep. Pass me some of that tape over there, says Sooty. The really sticky stuff. So Sweep does as he's told. Let's try this for size, says Sooty, and grabs the sheet of paper again, and well, things don't seem to be going very well. He seems to be wrapping himself up, not the book. Don't give up, Sooty. Dear, I think he's done just that. Oh, be careful, Sweep! Sooty's having a think. Oh, he's thought of something. What is he going to do? Ah, the magic wand. We might have guessed, mightn't we? Oh, look at that! Good things, these magic wands. When you're in a sticky situation. Well done, Sooty. Beautifully covered. Let's go and show it to Matthew, says Sooty. Come on, sweet, come on. Oh, Sooty's left his magic wand behind. There it is. Grab it, Sooty. Good boy. And next, grab Sweet and take him as well. Well, if nothing else... At least covering those books has kept those three little rascals quiet. I haven't heard a peep out of them for ages. Shh, listen to the silence. May it never stop. Oh, it stopped. Who made that noise? Oh, sorry, Matthew, it's only me. I've knocked this whole stack of pans over, sorry. Are you all right, Sue? Yes, I'm fine. I just never saw them. All right, let me give you a hand. Come on, we'll stack them up later. Come on, up you come. Are you sure you're OK? You sure? Yes, I'm fine, really. Uh, what's this? What is this? I brought my book to show you. Oh, that's super, that, Sue. Very nice indeed. I think we'd better wait until the other two are here before we look at them all. Where are Sooty and Sweet? Oh, dear. Sooty's arrived. And Sweep's arrived as well. Are you all right, you two? Come on up, come on up. Up you come, up you come. Come on. Goodness, are you sure you're OK? Well, come on, we're looking at the books now, so... It... Hey, is this your book, Sooty? Oh, that is fantastic. Really, it is. Uh, mind you, mind you, I think perhaps you, uh, perhaps you had a little bit of help there, didn't you? Yes, I thought you did. But it's very good, even so. Let's have a look at yours, Sweep. Just gonna have a look at Sweep's book. What's that? That's your book? Is there a book inside here? It's to be hoped it's a book that nobody wants to read very often. But can you have a look at one of mine? Oh, yes, let's see one of the books you've covered, Matthew. All right, uh, well, there's one down there, so you go and bring it up. Go on, down you go. Matthew, one what? thing has been puzzling me. Why is it a good idea to cover books? Well, it's to stop them from getting dirty or sticky, Sue. You know? How on earth would a book get dirty or sticky? Oh, well, you could always... Well, I suppose... Uh... Actually, come to think of it, I don't have a clue. I can't imagine how a book would get dirty. I would... <clears throat> Does that answer your question, Sue? Uh, yes, perfectly. Oh, look at that. We'll have to clean that up later, for goodness sake. Uh, what's wrong with Sweep? I don't know. Oh, Sweep's crying. You're a, you feel a failure? Why? Why? What's the matter, Sweep? Why do you feel a failure? Your book's no good? Oh, I wouldn't say that, Sweep. It's, uh, it's, um, it's different. That's all different. It's not as good as Sooty's. Ah, oh, well, Sooty did have a little bit of help. You will? Hey, look, just relax. Bring it up here. Sooty's going to help you as well. He's going to give you a little help. So stand by. Wave the magic wand, Sooty. Go on. Well, uh, where's it? What's happened to his book? Where's it? Is that? Sooty. I thought you were going to give him a little help, not a little book. Look at the size of that. It's minuscule. Look, wave the magic wand and give him a bigger book. Go on, a bigger one. Oh, dearie, I wouldn't like to try and cover that. Come on, look at the size of that. I wouldn't like to try and right. lift it. Never mind, cover it. Wave the magic wand and give him a sensible size book. Go on. Really? Hey, look at that, Sue. Oh, that's a beauty. Just look at that. Well done, Sooty. So, Sue, everybody and everything is just tickety-boo now. Uh, um, not quite tickety-boo, Matthew. Why not? What's wrong? Well, that great big book left a little damage behind. Look at poor old Sooty's mug. Oh, look at that. The handle's been knocked off it. You're going to get a tube of glue? No, 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 come back here, come back here. I don't want you touching the glue. I can imagine what would happen if you did that. Stay where you are, I'll handle the glue. It's down here somewhere. Yeah, it's all right, I've got it. I've got it. 
I am going to handle the glue, so you take the top off. You take the top off. That's it. Okay, Sweet, can you uh, can you grab hold of the handle? Just oh, you, Matthew, you I hand. could do that for no, you. No, it's all right, Sue. I'm in charge of the glue. Okay, it's very powerful stuff. Turn it round. That's it. I'll put the uh, glue on there. There we go, like that. All right, all right. And Sweet, can you hold the handle up against it? Thank you very much. Oh, do you want me to hold the glue, Matthew? You? Uh, no, Sue. No, oh. no. Thank you very much, because I have told you before that the glue must remain with a sensible and a responsible grown-up. Uh-oh. What's wrong, Matthew? Uh, nothing, Sue. No, nothing at all. <laughs> well, what was that noise? Nothing, Sue. Nothing. Just, uh, just got a bit of a... Got a bit of a... Froggy, but... A bit of a... Frog... Oh. 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 <laughs> Did you say responsible? Uh, well, I, uh... <laughs> and sensible. Well, well, I, uh, what? And grown up? Well, yes. <laughs> Just goes to show how careful you've got to be with glue. Yes, well, it may have stuck your shirt OK, but it hasn't been so successful with Sooty's mug. Look. What? <laughs> oh, look, the mug's still not fixed. You know how to do it? You do? The magic wand? Of course, the magic wand. Go on, wave it, Sooty. Hey, look at that! It's worked! Why didn't I think of that? Much earlier. Ah, oh, we're giving up with the sticky stuff. Too much aggravation. Decided to do something completely different. They've actually decided to uh, make some papier-mâché. Do you know how you do that? You soak newspaper till it's all soft and wet, and then you make things with it, models and that. Anyway, the, do you know what the little monkey said? Could they soak the newspaper in the bath upstairs? Well, I said no. I said they've got to go to the garage and put it in an old washing-up bowl. You... <laughs> Have we got some more paper? <laughs> yes, there's lots here. Look, take, take this and put this in the water, OK? But, sweet, remember, when you're making papier-mâché, the key word is soaking. You've got to do some thorough soaking. Now, what is the key word? Soaking. And what do you have to do? Some thorough soaking. So off you go, Sweep, and do some thorough soaking. Go on. Oh, you've got more paper. Oh, goody. In it goes. That's it. Now, let me help you, Sweep. There. Now, why don't you go and get a spoon sweep as well? That's it. Now, make sure all the paper goes beneath the surface. Right. Stop! Stop! Let's have a look at it. You don't think it looks right, Sooty? No, neither do I. It doesn't look right. There's something missing. Ah! I've got it! The sticky stuff! You're supposed to put something into paper mache to make it bind together. What it needs is some sticky stuff. Sooty, you go and ask Matthew if he knows what it is you have to put in, and I'll go and have a look in my hobbies book. It may say something there. What is the key word? Soaking. And what do you have to do? Some thorough soaking. So off you go, sweep, and do some thorough soaking. Go on. Of course, how silly of me. The thing that makes papier-mâché stick together is flour. How much will you need? Well, for a roll that size, probably about 150 grams. How much is 150 grams? Well, if you don't know now, you jolly well should do. Go and get the kitchen scales. They're down there somewhere. That, bring, bring them up. That's it. And the flour's down here. So, will you add the flour? Put it in that bowl, Sooty. You're good at doing this. Well, I hope you are. Put, put some flour in the bowl. That's it. Philip, be careful. Careful. Care oh, All right, it's near enough. Put that on there, like that. Could you go and... Th there's a 150-gram weight down there as well. We get... Look, be careful. Be careful. Be careful. It looks a bit heavy. Be Sooty, Sooty, I just <coughs> remembered what <coughs> you had to pay for your mashing. It's a... <coughs> 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 flour. <laughs> Yes, but the thing is, the flour should be added to the papier mache, not all over my head. <laughs> oh, look, just take what's left. Go on, take what's left. Put that in the bowl. I'll clear up in here. You can pour the flour in then, Sooty. Oh, sweet! What are you doing? 
doing in the paper mache? <laughs> You're soaking. <laughs> soaking is the key word. Well, I think the key word here is bone brain. You will have to get out, sweet, because Sooty's about to have the flower. That's okay. You'll help to mix it in. Well, if you say so, sweet. Whack it in then, Sooty. <laughs> Go on then, sweet. <laughs> you see, I can use sticky stuff properly when I'm left alone. It's just those three that put me off. See this? This is as steady as a rock. Here we are. See? Matthew, oh. Matthew. What, what is it? What's, what's, is anything wrong? What's no, wrong, no, 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 nothing's wrong. We've just had a great time with the papier mache. Sooty will tell you about it when he gets here. Oh, he's coming. Oh, Come here on. he is. Up now. He comes, what, what, what have you done? A major success. Great news. What have you made? Have you made a, a model or a, or a mask or a. No, we've made a brand new fashion, Matthew. What? Show it to him, sweet. What is it? What? Oh. We've called it the concrete ballet. Dress. <laughs> Look at that! That's with all the flour you added. It's sticking it all together. What, Sooty? Sticky stuff has a lot to answer for. Yes. Well, I think it's more us lot that have a lot to answer for, Matthew. Yes, we're not terribly good at sticking these together, are no. we? But there is one sort of sticking that we all do rather well. What's that? I think we'd better say goodbye first, and then I'll tell you all about it. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. bye. Hang on. What is this? Pick that up. Look at this. This is supposed to be drawing pins in here. Look at that. Oh, no. Sticky. Stick, sticky. It's a sticky situation we've got. No, oh, that's naughty, Sooty. Sticky. Stick, sticky. It's a sticky situation we've got. Listen. If you find you're in a sticky situation, if you've finally fallen out with Lady Luck, well, there cannot be a greater aggravation than to find that all your plans have come unstuck. Hey, sticky, 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 it's a sticky situation we've got. Where's the half of this? Sticky, 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 it's a sticky situation we've got. Sing, Sue. If you find you're ever stuck for conversation, can you pass me some tape, please? The words somehow. That, that's it, Sue. It's Thank a you. very, very peculiar sensation. Like a piano with a Wait. badly sticky note. No, you're going to get yourself that. Sticky, stick, sticky. It's a sticky situation we've got. We certainly have. Sticky, stick, Sorry, sweet, get it off there. It's a sticky situation we've got. And so we'll all stick together. Stick around to help each other through. Where birds on the feather, you're, you're stuck, stuck with me and I am stuck with you. Sing to. We'll all stick together. That's true. We'll stick it up till everything's alright. We're friends together. Just like a blob of glue, we are stuck tight. Listen, sticky. Stick, sticky, it's a sticky situation we've got. What are we going to do about that? Sticky, 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 it's a sticky situation we've got. Listen, if you find yourself about to fall to pieces, just pull yourself together for a bit. Because the answer is, wonders never ceases. It's a tube of glue from my construction kit. Clever, Sooty, eh? Sticky, sticky, sticky. It's a sticky situation we get. No, not on my fingers, please. Sticky, sticky, sticky. It's a sticky situation we've got. Near enough. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs>